Okay. Good morning. Uh, let's see. Let get a better angle. July 1st. That's where we are. Um, just got downstairs. Just got done waking everyone up. Getting ready. We have to go pick up groceries in a little bit. I'm letting Charlotte um, drink her bottle <sighs> and trying to get the kids dressed as what about your tablet? You don't want to watch animals? Well then pick something else. Um, I'm just now opening up everything and turning off all the oh my god all the lights and whatnot to start the morning. Um, yesterday, or the day before, Josh cleaned up the backyard. So the backyard's all cleaned for, hopefully tonight when he gets home from work, he can go ahead and put the pool out. But I'm letting Charlotte drink her bottle and the kids grab their tablets after they had gotten dressed. So we can go to Walmart to pick up our groceries. I'm trying to find like a good angle where you can see me and I'm not like, um, but so that's kind of the gist of what we're doing today. I'm going to pick up my groceries and then we'll do a grocery haul and then What am I doing after that? I might try to, I'll probably try to clean upstairs. I don't know if I'm gonna film it or not just because they run around the house and go crazy and there's a lot of me having to stop and like move them or you know clean up the mess that they've made. So I don't know if I'm gonna record when I clean just because it's kind of chaotic but maybe I should just so everyone knows what it's like when you have more than you know one kid. Um, but I do need to clean upstairs and I need to do another load of laundry and I need to try to put clothes away. I dyed my hair again last night. I bought extensions that I was going to do and put in but I couldn't figure out how to do it and then I realized that I only bought one thing which is for the back and I didn't buy any for the side so my hair doesn't look normal when the back is long and then the side and the front part is short. So today the kids are playing their tablets like I said they're over there they just grabbed them while I was waiting to get Charlotte ready Charlotte's over there she just finished her bottle I have to get Jackson dressed real quick and I think I was going to go ahead and throw on a little bit of makeup and we get shoes and all that stuff on um, I don't really do anything fancy. The last few days that I have been doing makeup, I'll do like a full face. I notice I've been dealing with the back and forth allergies because the weather's been going crazy. So that's why I keep like touching my nose, doing that. Like I'm trying not to, but in the morning is when I sneeze the most. And when I, um, like when I just wake up, obviously everything's there. Plus my cat was in there this morning. She was laying on top of me. So that probably didn't help. But I took my Benadryl. So hopefully it'll kick it in a little bit. But I'll go ahead and do my makeup. And then I'll see you guys after. Okay, I don't know if you can, you know, tell or whatever. But I just got done doing my makeup. I just threw on, like I said, the eyeshadow, eyeliner, mascara, the setting. And then I just put lip gloss on. And I put my nose bake. No, the... My nose ring back in. I have no idea if you can tell. Um, but I'm all done with that. Um, but yeah, I'm all ready now. Uh, I gotta see what time it is so I can get the kids in the car. It's almost nine o'clock. Um, I'm about to go get the kids ready to go put them in the car. Um, Charlotte's all done with her milk and I obviously got ready and the other two minus Jackson because I still need to get him in his underwear real quick um, are ready to go I was just texting my husband I got an email from Kirkland's 
that was saying that for my birthday I get 25% off an entire transaction on top of a free gift in the store and so I was showing him that and he was telling me that um, you know I can do that soon but um, we're just about to get ready to go grab the groceries mama hey did you just say mama did you just say mama did you just say mama but she normally says dada and then she'll do like hi like she just did but um we're about to go grab the groceries i've said that like four times i know i keep stopping and having to pee myself and obviously crazy down there is making lots of noise um normally like i have everything set up in the car and i think like if i do something with someone else in the car like whenever i do i want to i was telling Brittany about it i want to do the um car challenge the one where you order what the person in front of you ordered i want to do that with her because her and i are both super picky and i think it would be fun but for like see and now my allergies are messing up saying i have the dash mount in the car and whatnot but normally excuse me normally when i'm in the car i like to listen to music especially for like road trips and whatnot like when we took jackson for his thing i normally don't pull the camera out i'll have it with me i'll have it in the diaper bag but i don't pull it out in the car because for me when i'm driving i like to listen to music i like to sing i like to relax we drove up to maryland for his appointment the kids would not stop fighting and screaming at each other and whatever so unless it's something big or unless i'm with someone else i probably won't do anything in the car um i'll probably just wait till i get home or wait till i get to the destination um, but I'm about to load them up after I change Jackson and we're going to go pick up our groceries. I'm probably going to stop for coffee and then go pick up groceries because it's already 840. So by the time I get my coffee and start heading to the Walmart that I went to last time, which is over by my friend Brittany's house, past the mall, they got everything right. Um, it'll probably be ready. Because it takes me about 10 years to get them all in the car and he still has to get dressed. He thought that he got himself dressed this morning by putting on his pants with his pajama shirt. And on top of, he didn't put any underwear on. Because normally we have the underwear down here because that's where we get dressed. I should probably keep some up there if he's going to continue to get dressed like that in the morning. Um, to save me some trouble. But enough of me talking. I'll show you them real quick. And then we're going to go get our stuff and I'll do the haul once we get home. Charlotte. Charlotte. Hi. Hi. What? What are you doing? You trying to play with the Barbie? The big Barbie? What? What? All right, Jackson, we got to get you dressed. You got to get underwear and your clothes on. Your clothes are right there. And we got to go pick up our groceries. Groceries. Hey, we'll see you later. No, it, it doesn't work in the car, baby. We got to get dressed. Anyway, I got this big, huge thing of provolone cheese that I use for sandwiches. And I also put it on my meatball subs, which I like better. Jay, I like it more than the mozzarella cheese on the meatball subs. I like the provolone better. It melts better. Um, the bacon that I'll do for a snack or in my turkey sandwiches, six Lunchables, three for each child. The chocolate chip waffles. And there's the pizza down there. I got another thing of French toast bites because the kids like that for breakfast. I got these, but I got those two things of dinosaur chicken nuggets, uh, vegetable oil for my baking, and then um, just to have on hand again. Three things of corn on the cob, a two pound bag of carrots. I only asked for one pound, but they substituted for two, so that's, I mean, I guess that's not bad, but I might not use it all. Uh, my favorite pickles, I got them in the spear kind. 
Um, I asked for blueberries. They substituted with blackberries. Jade does eat blackberries, so it's not that big of a deal. And strawberries, English muffins. Um, I also got some rice, and this is the cereal that Jackson likes to eat. I bought crock pot liners for when I make stew, and I also have a turkey in the fridge that I may um, throw in the crock pot and see how to do. Some more saran wrap, trash bags, dish soap, and my dishwasher thing. I think that's everything that I got. So that's everything that I got from the store. I also have a whole bunch of stuff that's already in here um, that normally I will, that I'll probably go through and I'll need more next time. But that's everything. Now I'm going to put it away. I'm going to freeze the bags and then I think I'm going to throw the turkey in the crock pot and see how to do that. So once I'm done... Alright, so we just got done eating lunch. Actually, Jade's chicken nuggets are just now done. Um, but I had a turkey sandwich, like I was explaining, with the bacon and all of that stuff. And Jackson asked for a cheese sandwich. Jade wanted some chicken nuggets, so hers just finished. I just got done eating Jackson. Just got done eating. I gave Charlotte some Cheerios. Um, I ate, and they're all over the floor excuse me change her and make her a small little bottle and put her down for a nap and then when she wakes up from her nap because I didn't normally what I'll do in the morning is she'll get her bottle and like an hour before her nap I'll go ahead and I'll make her some baby foods and I'll do the rice cereal a little bit and then I'll mix with um, baby food normally is like apples or bananas or something or peaches or mangoes Whichever um, I have and I want to give her. So I'll do that. And then she'll take her nap about 45 minutes after that. But because we went out <clears throat> and got the groceries and um, came back, put it all away, filmed it. Had to continuously stop because of the kids. Made lunches, all of that. Um, I'm just going to give her a small bottle to hold her over until after she wakes up from her nap. Then she'll wake up. And she'll have that and then something in like three hours from then it'll be like her late lunch or whatever snack and then she'll have dinner either before or after us the turkey I got um, it's actually a roast and it only needs to go in for about two and a half hours almost three so I'll probably put it in around two o'clock so then hopefully by five it would be done so I will do that later and I'm just gonna roast it in the oven instead of the crock. I'm gonna go ahead and get her ready for her nap and have the kids. Jade's gonna eat her lunch and Jackson's going to have his quiet time while I put her down. And then after, I think I'm gonna work with him on some of the school stuff that we need to do. So we'll see you after nap time. All right, so I just got done putting Charlotte down for her nap. It's 117. She took a little bit longer to go down for her nap. I also had to rinse her off because she has a little bit of a rash in her butt. So I rinsed her off, let her air dry for a little bit, and then put some cream on, put her diaper on, let her finish her bottle, and then started to put her to sleep. Uh, I just got done cleaning up my sink and washing bottles, sippy cups, all of that stuff, and I put the turkey in the oven. Um, it says to leave it in the bag and it'll roast. So it's in there. I literally just put it in. So um, probably around like 3, 3.30 I'll look at it, um, see where it is. Hopefully it's not done before then. It also came with a gravy pack that apparently I can pour some of the turkey juices into a measuring cup. I add water and then I boil. I guess this is what I pour into that gravy pack I'm gonna do potatoes I was gonna steam some carrots but I don't know if I want to do that or not um, but everybody's still having their quiet time I just got done cleaning up throwing dinner into the oven now she's napping I might have him tomorrow night when he gets home from work take my car to go get its oil change today when I was coming back from getting the groceries I had noticed I know I'm over and I need to get an oil change regardless but I could smell oil from the car as I was driving like through the air conditioning I guess and then when I got out 
to get the kids out and unload the groceries and everything I also smelled it so I don't know if that's just it telling me that it's like really overdone or what I don't know but we will see um, okay so that was fun um, I just got done feeding her she woke up from a nap a little bit a while ago I've been checking the turkey on and off and I went to pull it to check the temperature and my pan, I don't know if it's because it's old, I don't know if it's because it's just not that great or what, but it's split in half. So there's the pan that I was using to roast the turkey. It now has to be in a different pan. And because it cracked, and I went to pull the bag, I guess pulling the bag the way that I did because it's been cooking, it ripped a hole so some of the juices are already out. Hopefully that won't change anything, it'll just be some of the juice that I can pull and put into the stuff. My husband's texting, we were talking about cars at the moment. Um, but so that... That was a blast. I burnt my finger as well. So, there's my finger. It's nice and burnt. Um, it also has the, um, the dust in the, not the dust, the um, burnt stuff from the stove because the stove needs to get cleaned. I'll try to do that tomorrow. But my pan broke in half. And I'm going to do, let you guys know that my freaking turkey, it smells delicious and it looks good, I think. It'll probably be done around like 3.34. I'm about to start peeling potatoes and start those. I'll do them low instead of the normal high like I normally do. Just so they have time so everything's not like rushed when Josh gets home, whenever that is. And figure out where and how to throw this away. Or at least move it so I can throw it away later. Hopefully that didn't just burn the freaking water. Because it's still piping hot and I can't, I can't touch it. But that was the joys of uh, this Rachel Ray pan. It is trashed. Just straight, straight down the middle, broke. So, but I'm gonna go ahead and continue to, sorry, prep the rest of dinner and talk to my husband about the whole car situation that we're talking about. Um, it's not so much that we need to get a different car because I just got my van last October. So I haven't even had it a full year, but we had it for 10 months. But the other day when Nicole came over to drop off her daughter, so her and her other daughter and her husband can go see Toy Story 4 instead of bringing the baby, um, she had texted me right after she left and I, she said, you know, oh, I forgot to tell you when I was in there, like, the side of your, your van was open. And I'm like, okay, what, like, it's not supposed to do that. And the night before, I had come home from Brittany's house and it started to rain. So I know that it wasn't, like I shut everything, I locked everything, so I don't know if the car decided to malfunction or if Jade had grabbed the keys and unlocked it, but she was never near my keys, that's the problem. So I don't know what happened there, but it's that. And then today, as I was driving home from the grocery store, I think I might've already told you this in another clip, it needs to get an oil change. <laughs> But without it getting an oil change, it smells when I'm driving it. I don't know if that's like killing it or whatever. Not to mention the last time that I got my oil changed over at Kia, they told me that my brake pads were going, even though they had just given me the car like three months beforehand. And my engine battery was going, which it shouldn't be when you just bought the car from them. So we're running into those issues and I've been looking at Suburbans and Expeditions and that type of stuff. Um, I was also talking to a guy about another van. It's just a Sienna, um, but I don't know how that would work, but that's kind of, we're talking about cars and the situation and trying to go from there. Um, but that's the gist of that. So I'm gonna continue to um, finish making dinner and get Jade some more strawberries or tuck her in, whatever she wants me to do. And once dinner is done, I will show you the final product because right now I'm just, I, I'm a little flustered because my pan split in half and I had to clean the bottom of my floor because the turkey juices came out, but hopefully it'll still taste good. Pray for me. Final product, there's the potatoes. There's my turkey. <laughs> 